Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome to another one of Huggy's Quick Beer Reviews. Today we have something I've been looking forward to. Today we have this. This is the Sierra Nevada Harvest Series, the Wet Hop Ale. This is the 2009 13th release version. This just came out. Take a look at that guy right there. This just came out in October. I believe this has only been out a few weeks. This is the latest uh, 2009 release. I picked it up last Friday. Today's Monday. I've been waiting all weekend to get at this because I have been dying to try a wet hop ale. Um, I've become a hop head over the years. I'm a big fan of IPAs and I'm intrigued by this whole wet hop thing. Um, for those who don't know what a wet hop ale is, let me read what it says here. Uh, our harvest ale was the first American ale ever brewed with 100% fresh picked wet hops. In just one day, we harvest hops in Yakima, Washington, ship them that night to our brewery in Chico, California, and then rush them into the brew kettle as they are unloaded at dawn the next day. This extraordinary effort creates an ale with unmatched aromatics of pine and citrus with layers of spicy sweet notes that hop fanatics like us dream of all year. Enjoy. And I plan to. And I want you to join me. So, here we go guys. Sierra Nevada, Harvest Series, 13th release, White Hop Ale my usual IPA goblet and let's see what this thing is like hmm I, I regret uh, not picking up a second one I'm probably gonna have to go back because uh, I think this is gonna be really good um, I should note this is 6.7% uh, ABV and this is not a 22 ounce bottle this is a 24 ounce bottle props to Sierra Nevada for giving us two extra ounces so ooh smoky. I like that. Well, let's take a look. Let's take a look. This is a very interesting color. And that is giving a ridiculous amount of head. Wow. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Oh, that is a good looking beer. That is a copper color and that is a whole lot of creamy off-white head. Take a look. See if that, uh... And I know my camera sucks, but, you know, get an idea of what the colors look like. Mmm. This looks good. Let's see. Mmm. Smells happy. No surprise there. But, yeah, it's... It's not your regular hop smell. Mm. It smells like buds. <laughs> um, you know what, I'll just be shot out and say it. Uh, hops and cannabis are from the same family. They're very similar bud-like green things that grow on trees. It's no surprise that they smell similar. Yeah, yeah, this smells like good stuff. It really does. It really does. I'm getting that oily, fresh moist bud hop smell and I'd be lying to you if I said I picked up anything else it's floral, it's piney it's piney citrus but it's a different, this is not your typical IPA piney citrus smell it smells better if you ask me and that uh, copper, almost a reddish color that is a pretty color it really is, I'm digging in cheers Wow. Again, that wet hop, that fresh, moist bud, taste is there. It's that taste, it's that texture. It's hoppy, man. But I mean, this is for those for those that don't know. Um, wet hop ales, or at the very least, this one, it categorizes IPAs. But this is it's like a subcategory of IPA because this is not going to taste like your typical India pale ale. Um, there's just a different there's a different uh, what's the word I'm looking for here there's there's more complexities to the hop it's a different hop character now you do get mm, a nice smooth amount of malt holding it together 
it's hoppy. I mean, it tastes like a Sierra Nevada beer, but this is good. I mean, you have to like hops to like this beer. The hops aren't as sharp. It, it doesn't bite as much as some IPAs. And even though you get the hoppiness on the finish, there's no resin. It's not that hop oil resin that lingers on the tongue forever. It's much more smoother. It's much more smooth. It's much more subdued. Again, like I said, this has to be like a, a subcategory of IPAs. But this is tasty. This is good stuff. If you're an IPA fan, if you're a hop head, you need to try this beer. And, um, you know, they say the fresher the better. This just came out. This is uh, 2009, 13th release. It was released, I believe, in very early October. Get you some now. Get it fresh. Try it. This is good stuff, man. Um, it's very IPA-ish. This is very well made. It's... It's about medium, a light medium mouthfeel. Um, it's not heavy. Look at that. That lacing is sweet. That head is not going anywhere. This is a very, very well put together brew. Sierra Nevada, again, did not disappoint. Good stuff. Good stuff. Yeah, good stuff. Check it out, guys. There's not much more I can say about this. This is a solid IPA, a solid brew. Wet hop is the shit. What the hell? The full review is going to be up on BeerBreath.com. What can I say, man? Thanks for sharing a beer with me. Check some out. Check. Go check some of this stuff out. This is good. For IPA fans, a must. Have fun, guys. See you next time. Cheers. Oh. Yeah. Oh, man. Good stuff. <laughs> Take it easy.